Billy, I just don't see how we have a choice, man. I have a choice. I'm free. I'm not a slave. I have a choice. Jim, I love you, man, but since you've hit middle age, you really lost something. Yeah, and since you've fucking been strung out on this shit, you've lost something. You fucking mind. Easy, Jim. Look who the fuck you're speaking to, huh? Hey. What's up? I'm just trying to explain to our friend here that possession is nine-tenths of the law. We should make the slopes pay us back. Billy, I got Chad on the phone. Pay us back for what? Look, we have a business opportunity here, Johnny. You think a guy like you should be pleased? Yeah, but Jim says there's some problem. There is. That H we stole. It belonged to the Chinese. The deadbeats told them we got it and they want it back. So? Fuck them. Finally! Billy, Chad's on the phone about the meeting. Look, normally I'd be down for that, but these aren't the type of dudes you just say fuck them to. There's some heavily armed, pissed off motherfuckers who killed a couple of angels when they found out this shit was gone. Now I'm thinking maybe we could strike up a deal with them. Okay. Okay. Yeah, why don't you just suck him off while you're at it? <laughs> and tell Chad I'm sober as can be over here! That's what I told Look, him! Look, I just think that given this war we're back into with the Angels of Death, and given the fact that one or possibly two government agencies are looking into our shit, that offloading the heroin would be a good idea, all right? And looking for a fight is the wrong thing to do right now, given the fact that we can't even stop fighting amongst ourselves. Yeah, you're right. We should probably all get in a circle, hold hands, pray, sing kumbaya. Kumbaya. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> this ain't no joking matter, Billy. We'll either end up dead in the ground or back in the lockup with you. I ain't going back there. I'd rather be dead. Damn straight. Well, you don't have to do either, man. I just think that getting rid of that stuff now is the right thing to do. Okay. Cops are poking around, Bill. We should chill out. You haven't been talking, have you? Don't go forgetting what happened when Horse sang his little ditty. I'd never talk to a pig. But there's a lesson to be learned, all right. You forgotten your place, soldier? Stay behind the ride, Captain. I'm surprised Billy agreed to this. It's the first smart move he's made since getting out of rehab. Yeah, maybe he's starting to calm down. Maybe he's stuck too much of that brown into his arm.
Well, Bill, I may have beat you, but you're still the fucking man in my book. Oh, shit. Jim, Johnny, since you two were both so vocal in your support of this deal, you two are going to be the ones to hand over the brown to the slopes. What? What are you and your boy here going to be doing? We are going to watch your backs, because unlike this fat man here, I just don't trust those little yellow bastards. Good luck. Hey, they don't need luck. We're looking out for <laughs> This better be cool, man. So, Johnny, this is, uh... Mm. Okay. We gonna be cool and do this thing? So let me get this straight. You are here to sell us back our heroin. The heroin my cousin sweated over in order to bring to this country only to have it stolen. Look, man, we can do business or go to war. It's your call. In this country, they seem to be the same thing, you stupid pieces of shit! Fuck you! We're gonna have to fight our way out of here! See, you fucking ready for this? Shit's fucked. Billy's been taken down. Where are you? Bill, yeah, he's fucked out. Thanks to you. I'm around the corner. We're coming. Wait there. Dude, this feels weird. Let's get to the banks. Suspect William Gray arrested in Chinatown incident. Units back down. I don't know, man. Billy sounded pissed. Why'd he bring me in? Cleavance, man, what the fuck? What happened back there? Hey, come on, move it!
right, Brian. I'd like to know what the fuck went down as well. Jesus, that was heavy, man. Fuck it. What was Billy's fucking problem? Ha! Nothing wrong with him, buddy. You two want us to end up all dead? Man, Billy was right about you. I knew you were a rat. Now he's gone, man. He ain't gone, Brian. He's gone to prison. He's not dead. You ratted him out. You ratted him out. No, I didn't. He nearly got me fucking killed. You set us up. You always wanted to be the one, the man. You're a gimp, Johnny. A gimp and a fucking Judas. What the fuck are you talking about, you ass-kissing little weasel? Hey, Brian! Johnny's not like that, Jim, man. you're wrong, man. I know you're a good guy, but this dude prick, he fucked us over, man. He set us up and he called the cops. And you know why? Because they're putting heat on him. They saw him, and they've been calling him. I know, because they did the same to me. And they told me you ratted us out. You keep talking like that, you are dead, my little friend. Now, fuck you, man. What? You sent Billy to jail, huh? Show us your phone. Prove you ain't been speaking to the law. I don't prove shit to you, and I didn't talk to no one. Fuck it. Come on! You stay away from us, you hear? Jim, I guess I gotta take over as chapter president now. When people hear about Billy going down, there's gonna be more pressure on us than ever. We gotta get through it. Brothers for life, man. Lost forever. I'll see you soon. <laughs> 